happy Sunday beavers. Um, so I am clearly late in my video, but so, so is Cade and so is Jess. Where are you guys? You are not off the hook for answering these questions, damn it. Anywho, I had some, some drama going on, some drama in my life. So, um, it's a weekend video and it's post pool time. Went to a friend's pool. Um, so you guys get me sans makeup, like legit not an ounce on me. Shit that never happens 101. <music> Just asked, how much would we, you know, have to make in a year in order to feel comfortable and happy and secure? Um, New York is incredibly expensive and starting a family is incredibly expensive and life is incredibly expensive. So, I mean, it would be, I think it would be great to uh, probably, I don't know, I, I, <laughs> I want to say something obnoxious like a stupid amount of money just because I'd want enough not to worry about like college for kids and providing and I'd want to give to charity and I'd want to make sure like my parents are taken care of so that that's like a lot of stuff so I don't know I think one of Jess's friends said like a million dollars I'd gladly take a million so that I could take care of everyone I'm I'm the type of person who likes to be a provider, you know, I'd want to give and give. So, so I'm going to pick an obnoxious number, right? I can, I'm going to go with a million. That's obviously way, <laughs> I feel the need to justify like that's a lot, but I'd, I'd want to do a lot of good with it. Um, what are you currently reading? I am currently not reading anything. I'm not a big reader actually, but I am going on vacation. Um, yes, next week I leave on Saturday. I'm so freaking excited. I'm going for a week. So if anyone has any book suggestions, leave them down below. I'd love to hear them because I'd like to get a book and read on vacation. Uh, what magazines do you subscribe to from Lori? Uh, actually, I don't subscribe to any magazine. Uh, I do, however, get Newsweek, <laughs> but I never asked for it, so I'm sure one of these days I'm going to get a um, bill in the mail. Uh, what is the best thing you cook? So I think the best thing I cook is I do this breaded chicken thing. It's healthy though. It's like whole wheat breaded. Um, and then I'm really good at vegetables. I've been trying to eat healthy. So I know AJ said she's awesome at Brussels sprouts, but I think I could give her a run for her money on Brussels sprouts. Not chili, but Brussels sprouts. So AJ asked me, AJ, it's funny. I don't, I, I mean, I don't know if I'd qualify myself as a foodie, but you're right. I do like to eat out a lot and I do like to eat. Um, you know, it was a very loaded lesbian question the way you framed that and you kept on catching yourself, which I thought was hilarious. I'm like, you know, don't ask a lesbian what she likes to eat. It's just, you know what answer you're gonna get. But if this was my last supper and, and I had to eat at a certain restaurant, I actually wouldn't eat at a restaurant. I want my mom's uh, cooking. She is an incredible, incredible, incredible cook. And then I guess I have to answer my own question. And I love that Lori pointed out like it's five things and there's only four of us when we take one of us out and we can't exactly, you know, date ourselves or... I mean, maybe you could, but it may be awkward. Uh, so thank you for catching that. So I will I will take the best friend thing out as well. Um, so who would I date? Who would I marry? Who would I have a one night stand with? And who would be my best friend? So uh, for best friend wise, I would have to pick Kate because you know, like Lori and AJ um, are kind of best friends. Me and Cade are kind of best friends. So that would be an easy Cade's my best friend. Uh, if I, let's see, date, what do I have left? Dating, one night stand, and marry. So um, I'd probably want to do one night stand <laughs> with Jess. Can I say that? I mean, I want to date her and marry her too, but um, I'd pick Jess for my one night stand. For dating wise, I'd have to pick AJ. I think 
I think AJ it would be such a good dater and just be very thoughtful with like places to go and what to do. Uh, so I would date AJ and I would probably marry Lori because I think <laughs> I think she'd even out my I hate the morning sort of mentality. Lori loves the morning. I think she's just such a happy good person and I'm not saying I'm neither happy nor good but like she is super happy and super good all the time and I think that would be a good influence on me. On a total side note, Lori, I don't, what did I yell at you about? I don't remember yelling at you and I'm sorry. I mean, I'm glad you took it in that, oh, that's kind of sexy way because I would feel horrible if you took it in any other sort of way. I mean, Thank you for not leaving the beaver bunch after I yelled at you, and thank you for wanting a one night stand with me instead. I would be very aggressive just for that. Just just to make up for the yelling at you thing. I, I would be aggressive for you. So <laughs> with that, I will see you guys next week. Cade, I know you're at some crazy concert thing, but post a video, ask a question, answer these. All right. I will see you guys next week. Bye.